Good afternoon everybody and welcome to this week's collective worship. The theme for this week's collective worship is thankfulness. Now we may have heard that word or used that word ourselves, but being thankful is about feeling happy and grateful for something that has happened and things that are going to happen. It's a feeling that you get inside that you may show on the outside with a smile or with a happy gesture. Now, I have a question for you today. Have you said thank you today for anything? Have you had an experience today or has someone said something to you that has made you feel happy and want to say thank you for that experience? You might want to call it out now and that's okay if you don't want to. We're just going to remind ourselves of those moments. It could be helping you put on your clothes today if you find that a bit tricky. It could be helping with preparing a meal and someone has said thank you to you. It could be also you saying thank you to somebody for helping you do something. Maybe you're home learning, you're finding something a little bit tricky. I know at school I've heard lots of you saying thank you might be in the playground or in the classroom, even in the lunch hall when you're receiving your lunch. So being thankful is a really important way to show others that you appreciate what they are doing for you. Um, I know that it's a bit strange at the moment, home learning, so I know there's lots of things that we think we're missing out on, but we can be thankful that we have got our lovely home learning activities to continue to carry on with at home and to share that learning with your adults at home. Sometimes the day might get so busy that you might forget things that you thought, wow, that was a really great moment or someone said something really wonderful to me and you forgot to thank them for it. Because sometimes we're so busy with things that we're doing, we forget those moments. Um, what I'd like you to do if you want to this week then is to create a thankfulness journal. What you could do is you could draw or write uh, some things down that have happened this week that you might be thankful for or something that has happened that somebody has thanked you for. And it'd be really lovely when we get back to school if you want to share these with your teachers just to remind us about those moments, even in this strange time of home learning, that we can be thankful for lots of things. It doesn't have to be something big, it can be something small, something someone may have said to you or helped you with. A really good way that would be to share those thanks together. And I know that we as a community have been thanking lots of people on a Thursday by clapping and making as much noise as we can. It's a really lovely way to show our appreciation for all of those out there who are supporting us. So I want you now just to close your eyes if you would like to, or put your hands together, and we're going to end our collective worship with our school prayer. Dear God, help us in our work each day. Give us concentration so that we may listen, understanding so that we may learn, and peaceful minds so that we may remember. In God's name, Amen. <laughs>